Want to know what's really going on? Watch my life in an unfiltered way? Click the link below and follow my Patreon for mukbangs and drama. Not allowed on YouTube. Link below. Try to be spiritual in the middle of the night. It's Nancy, Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. I'm quite alright. Nancy, I'm sick of all of your invoices. I'm sick of you wasting my money. I am sick and tired of your unprofessionalism. And you know what? I've had it up to here. I've had it up to here. Your fault, Nancy. You're giving me diarrhea. You guys, so I have some news for you. I think I'll be posting this tomorrow. If I post this tomorrow, that means I survived. Okay, so you know what I was supposed So yesterday, we unlocked a new Nikocado, didn't we? Yes. We got a new level unlocked up in here in this space. And you guys know red. Red shirt means meltdowns. Black shirt means professional. Green shirt means I go vegan. Blue shirt means I'm blueberry and crying a lot. We got gray shirt. Okay, we unlocked the gray shirt. And the gray shirt means that I was really sad and serious. So thank you to everyone who left nice comments. A lot of people were saying, just go do it. It won't hurt. Go, go do it. You should be okay. But I, you know, I respect people's personal decision to get, that's what I believe. Personal decision and got to make a decision for yourself. There's risk each way. And there's a lot of unknowns and a lot of question marks. Okay to do what you know you can get clots from one thing the original thing then you can get clots from the other thing to prevent it clots clots clotsy clots <sighs> by the way when i'm making this video i haven't gotten it done yet so okay let's hope i'm not being all silly when i get it done and i hopefully don't get anything but i could get something from not just the actual thing if you know what i'm saying and then you know there's risk where you know you could become paralyzed from getting you know what and be re debilitated for how long you know there's people who were, were out of their jobs there's people who are still trying to overcome the symptoms and then you have people who get the you know what and they get the same symptoms and pff, some people it's there's risk each way i think one might have a little more risk than the other but also we have to consider a lot of different it's individual you can't look at a person straight in the eyes and know for certain that they're gonna be okay based on their body you just can't such as orlin and his autoimmune disease for me with my body and my obesity even though it's just water weight it's just water weight I decided that for me and my body, the fact that I am two people's worth, two people's worth, I am two human beings, excuse me, I'm speaking, I am two human beings worth on this skeleton. I am putting so much strain on my cardiovascular systems and the respiratory systems. God knows what's really going, who knows? Okay, I supplement all I want. I don't know if that's enough. It's probably not giving my size. And again, personal decision. If you have someone that's homebound, they never leave, everything's brought to them, they have no social life, they aren't pressed to get something done than someone that works in social services, okay? Personal decisions for, for personal people. Some people just want to, for it to be approved. They didn't so much to ask. So I don't I don't like seeing in my comments either people saying, oh, how dare you even question it? Just run out and get it. Excuse me. It means that my brain's still working if I'm questioning, all right? And if I'm, if, if I'm nervous, I remember my violin teacher said, if you go out on stage and you're not nervous, that's actually when something's wrong. No matter how many years you've been playing, and he, you know, my violin teacher, he was like, you know, playing for 50 years, he's like, you still get nervous. He says, the question not, is not how to not be nervous. The question is how to deal with the nerves. Because if you actually don't get nervous for it, it means something ain't working up here and you ain't checked in. So you should get nervous. It means you're alive and you're thinking. So anyways, I didn't get it today. I was supposed to get it today. I had a lot of drama. And can I give a shout out to Amphrodite? I was watching, I don't, okay. I was watching his horoscopes from July and he was dead on about something in my life. And it was really freaky. And um, he just made something about August horoscopes or something like that. And it just happened today. And I usually don't believe in those things. It's just really interesting to me. I don't even know. And sometimes you can kind of like morph it to make it make sense. Ah, he really helps my 
mental disorder. Okay, so, feel better about life up in here. I am going to, well, I sent out, or excuse me, Uber Eats <laughs> to bring me something to eat so that I can survive and, you know, I have to eat to survive. And Nick, when you're editing this, make sure they can't see that thing on my tooth. Okay. If I put it here, it might fall. We're going to have it right here. Thank you. So I have a, a candle here so I can bring some good fortune and good luck into my life. It smells really good. It's peaceful. Oh, I had a big um, issue in my life recently. I had the stress went... Oh, excuse me. Oh, cheaper scrapers. The stress went away today. There was a resolution and I just felt an instant relief. Like, ah, oh, wake up, lifted off my shoulders. Just dealing with just dark energy and just people being mean. And I, again, I don't need, I'm not gonna go into it, but I was about to on here. I was like, shoot, do I review this or what? And this is just, I can't believe, like, I can't believe. And I just feel like, you know, certain times or certain situations, everyone has a lesson to be learned and people have to acknowledge where they mess up. And um, I did it, other people involved did it, but the person I was mad at never acknowledged where they messed up, just rarely. And it was just, it was just gross. So anyways, I just feel happy. I feel like everyone can learn from this. I feel like the, the resolution was fair. It was fair. And, um... Now we celebrate life and we keep going. So I'm really happy about, about that. Came at perfect timing because I'm about to get my beep. You know what? And that's kind of, that's another thing I'm stressing about. Oh, Jeepers Creepers. I'm really nervous. I'm supposed to get it today. But again, I was very preoccupied calling people and talking to people and drafting emails and getting receipts. And I was like, oh my God, I don't get paid. I should be paid for this part too. Dang. But you know, if you don't have succinct language, if you're not backing up your crap, with support, people don't take you seriously. People take you seriously when they see the serious effort put in. And that's when you, that's when, that's how you prevent getting taken advantage of, you know? So, anyways, that's what my day looked like. Tomorrow, I'm gonna go and get the you know what after a nice meal. I'm also vitamin C, all right? I know everyone's different, everyone reads different things. I know that if I'm doing this, which I am, I'm gonna load up on some vitamin C. You know, you 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 pee out the um, the excess, just like vitamin B12. You can't really have to, the fat soluble vitamins. You have to be careful with. But I'm on a special regimen routine with that. Um, oh my god! I just imagine like the the things catching on fire because of my weight. Okay, because as fat people, you don't absorb vitamins A, B. You don't utilize them as easily. Okay, they, it's you have to you have to really take care of yourself. As I eat McDonald's, yes, I, I sent Uber Eats, I mean Orlin Eats, out into McDonald's. And I'm waiting for him to get back. Apparently one of them was closed. It's like a private franchise thing, not you know, private owner, so they close whenever they want. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Should I drink the candle? No. Oh. So that's my day. I'm, I am actually less nervous for the you know what now than I was today, all day today and yesterday. I think it's because I've, I've had like a bunch of crap in my life piled up onto me and a big piece of it just got lifted today. You know, it was, I, as Aphrodite said in his horoscope, which I watched after it took place. And it was so freaky out. But he said Tauruses. He's like, Taurus, hello, any other Tauruses? You, you, you having problems yet? I think it manifests differently at time of month for different people. Mine kind of carried over from last month, the end of last month into the beginning of this month with the um, the tension. But um, str swimming upstream is what I've been doing for a while. Swimming upstream. And it feels... Huh, it feels good to let go and start fresh and... Sometimes you have to acknowledge that some things are just not fixable. You can only give people so many chances. And um, that's where I stand today. This is where I am. Cheers to that. I am alive. Every day is a new day. No matter how many hours you waste doing something, it's still a day. I'm someone too that tries to um, 
put myself in other people's shoes too in this situation I was involved with. I'm like, I feel bad too, because I feel like their job's hard too because they, they have to control so many things. And, oh my God, I mean, people are people and you're gonna get good people and you're gonna get bad people. Some people are just more talented than others. I hate to say it, some people are just better than others. And then it really stands out when you're, you know, it's like going to restaurants. I love pretty much every place to eat, but when I start having them back to back and side by side, or I do a comparison, all of a sudden the one that I was okay with, now they suck. Because I, I had a taste of brilliance. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? You know, it's like I used to think, what did I used to think? I used to think Sonic was amazing. And now, <laughs> oh my god, deja vu. Let's see here what's happening. Excuse me. Oh. Um. And now, I just, I don't even know if I'm making sense. I hope Orland could get to this McDonald's okay and put the order in because he just drove to a place and he, that was not really Nancy, that was Orland. <laughs> that was funny in the beginning. That was really Orland saying, they're closed. It says they're open, but they're closed. I'm like, I knew it. I knew it. I always should have known. So, I'm just gonna um, sit here and um, just think and take big deep breaths. I'm someone that um, has a lot of mental disorders, yes, but I um, I find so much soothing relief from music therapy, aromatherapy, light therapy. I have a little red light little machine. It makes me feel good. It makes me look youthful. <laughs> I have... Um, Music therapy, you guys know I listen. Well, you don't know, but I'm telling you now. I love meditative music, relaxing music, frequency H HZ relaxation, healing frequency music. I love orchestra music. I mean, shoot, I will today. I listened to bon, Bonnie Bear, and I just started crying. I just started crying. It was like a whole. It was a. It was a moment. It was a moment, and I'm like, ah, this is this is just where my heart is. Everyone has that thing that brings them that bliss and that 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 feeling of oh my god i feel like i'm divine some people that's sports <laughs> i don't know how they, how the heck you go come to that but okay <laughs> doing manual labor cheapers and then for some people it's painting art you know drawing for me it's listening to good mu good quality music good quality music and that's why I get so upset with the trash most people listen to. But it is what it is. Most people are trash. So anyways, um, in addition to those two things that I mentioned, the lights and the music, I love aromas. I love aromas. I love scents. Some people must think I'm really crazy. I got gifted some soap from someone. And I literally just kept smell smelling my hands all the time. <laughs> I'm like, am I mentally okay? Is this wrong? I mean, it, this is very compulsive behaviors. I just can't stop. And I'm like, no, I'm enjoying it. That's life. Why can't I enjoy it? Why is it, why is it a bad thing for me to enjoy the scent on my hands? You spe you, especially, you know, expensive soaps. People don't buy, spend my own expensive soaps, spend all that money if they don't want to smell it. If it had no scent, would you pay the money? No, you want it. You're paying for the scent. So smell it. Defeats the purpose of it, doesn't it? It does. So anyways, and, um, Last night I was having a panic attack and I washed my hands in the soap and I felt love because it was gifted to me, but I, the scent helped my mind like stop freaking out and it helped me calm down. It helped me, oh, oh my God. It helped me take a breath and take a pause. I'll never forget one time I was going through a thing switching schools and my mom gave me a, a a card that said something along the lines of the most important part of music is the rest without the rest it's all a blur the rests determine the phrasing you know it was just, the most important music is the pause which people don't think about but it's true. A nice long pause in between something, it changes everything. And that pause is necessary for new 
beginnings, a new phrase, a new series of notes. And people just love to rush and rush and rush and rush. And I have a tendency of rushing, although I'm pretty patient, which is crazy. Sometimes I feel like I'm not patient, but then that whole, whole, whole uh, horoscopes thing, they say Tauruses, which I am one, they say they're very patient. They're stubborn, they're hardworking, they will, they will work until they fall apart. Trisha Paytas, okay. <laughs> you know, we're like, what, four days apart or something? They love food. Yeah, she can't stop eating like me. But <laughs> we're jokesters. We like to have fun. But also, what was the thing? Oh, patient. Like, you will put up with stuff if you're determined to reach a goal. I thought that was just my mental disorder. But no. <laughs> That's what Tauruses do, apparently. I don't even know if I believe in any of this. But sometimes I feel like I do. Anyways, um... Yeah, I love scent, and that's all I'm trying to say. This candle is nice. I read something about candles giving you, uh, giving lung, lung cancer. I'm pretty sure they have some stuff out there about that to suggest that they might or that they do. Um, it's not hard to believe if you think about it. I mean, anything chemically burning, breathing, Excessive. I mean, they say people that work in perfume shops, which was always a dream of mine, by the way. I'm telling you, I've always loved scents. Trust me. I, you, you want me to love you forever? Buy me a little perfume. Buy me some nice men's perfume. Not the cologne. Not the Elle de Toilet. Or whatever it's called. I don't want no toilet. Toilets. No. I want some really good, strong perfume. Although, it can make me really sick, too. I start foaming at the mouth. It's kind of crazy. Anyways, <laughs> I just like sense and it helps me relax. And you know what? It's a, it's a risk I'm it's a risk I'm willing to take. <sighs> that's something that that's a lesson I really needed to learn with this whole you know what that I'm afraid to get that I'm going to be getting tomorrow. Ouch! I hope they go fast. I hope I'm just going to look the other way. Cheapers creepers. <sighs> I'm having anxiety, but Nick, calm down. It's okay. Whatever's meant to be is meant to be. Hmm. There's risks everywhere. And you can focus on being fearful of something, but then a new fear where you could, I mean, there's a risk to drive. There's a risk of using Wi-Fi. There's a risk of being in a high rise. My building could fall down. Did you, help, did you hear about the building in um, Miami? Was it Miami or? Uh, sunrise, something, something, Hialeah. It was like Miami area. The buildings collapsed. You know, every day is a risk. Airplane, eating food, choking on an apple seed. Do you know how many people die choking on seeds in like pits, like like the core of a peach? They just swallow it. They're like, oh, 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 dead. Oh. That dang peach took you out. <laughs> it's not funny, <laughs> but it is. <laughs> Wait, this is not funny. <laughs> Ouch. This is supposed to not be funny. Oh my God, Nick, you're gonna get canceled. Wait a minute. <clears throat> okay, I have not heard from Uber Eats, Orland Eats. Where's my food? I'm getting hungry. I haven't eaten all day, which was deliberate because A, when I'm anxious, I don't eat. B, if I don't eat, I actually have laser sharp focus and I did a lot of stuff today. I had to call so many people today, sit on hold and call my attorneys and call up meetings after Zooms and then I had to write this big old email. So, that took an hour. It's just like, I'm exhausted. But tomorrow's a nice day because I'm gonna do what I have to do. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get, get the little thing. Look the other way, Orland's gonna bring some alcohol swab, so if I pass out, I'll just sniff it and help alert my brain. And whatever happens, happens. And that's just, you have to make a decision and you have to, you just have to choose and do it. Choose not to, that's fine, choose not to. Do what's right for you and your body. Um, and my body's fat. My body is very, very bad. Um, so, 
shoot, since I'm doing this, I better, I might as well sign up for one of those incentives. It's like, get free pizza. Okay, we better, we might as well get free food out of this here. I think it's too late. All right, I think it's too, I think all those incentives have drifted away. I feel like I'm just doing it to, do, to make a decision that's right for me at this point. It's really not for free food. Although I could go for some. <laughs> Look at me having to get all these like little boosters because, oh, it's, because I'm too fat and yet they're gonna reward me with more fattening food. Ain't that ironic? Free Krispy Kreme donuts. Well, the food is probably gonna be here for 20 more minutes, unfortunately. What are all these people? And like, the line is massive. You people, it's 12.30 in the morning. Well, I'm gonna listen to some nice bunny there. You know, everyone meditates in different ways. Some people like silence. Some people like, oh, like a hum. I like music. You should see what happens to my head, especially if it's nice music. I get carried away, I get swept off this earth, and I'm floating in the clouds. Man. During my prime days, when I played violin, and my skills were really good, and I was working in New York, and um, actually right right before the end of my college is when I felt like, ooh, I, I can really make some, I just felt really connected with the music. I really was in synchronicity with my plane and you know I lost all those skills all right baby or excuse me people oh, oh excuse me I did not mean to breathe that oh god it's your fault I'm gonna wait downstairs you guys Orland is just the worst uber eats driver ever I ordered french fries I bread like a diamond. I ordered french fries, I ordered chicken nuggets, I ordered more french fries, I ordered more chicken nuggets. All I got today is three cheeseburgers. So, yeah, it's a thing. We're doing three cheeseburger bun bun. So, let's make a dramatic thing so people click this. <laughs> Shine bright like a diamond. Shine bright like a diamond. And we're gonna starve together. Oh, that's pretty. Can you believe this is all the food he got me? And it, he always calls, he always calls. Ooh, another dramatic thumbnail. There we go. Um, he always lets me know. Today he didn't just he didn't want to let me know what I ordered. We never pull away till we do. So what happened was I put it on the app. It was like 40 nuggets, five large fries, chicken sam no not chicken sandwich. Um, two Big Macs, a double quarter pound of cheese, the McDoubles. And then we he went to it and it wasn't open. So the app said reorder here. So I'm like, reorder there. He says it doesn't let me check. It just says you click I'm a, I arrived or something. So he didn't see if it reordered everything on that on that order. What happened was they ordered like they reordered like three things out of the twenty things. I don't know why. He didn't check to see if that's correct, and he also didn't show me when he got it. And there was a long line and traffic, but oh well. <sighs> You know, this could be my last video ever. That's the scary part. If something happens to me from the you know what tomorrow, I just want to let you know it's your fault. Bye. You know, I'm joking. Actually, I want you to know that. This YouTube thing has been a wild ride. Wanna get a video just for you? Surprise your friend and tell him, it's your fault, I'm Kali Corbett. Click the link below and get yourself a cameo. And, it's definitely changed my life. <clears throat> Double, qu oh, D quarter pounder with ch cheese.
changed my life. I've made some good friends. I made some good money. I've got a lot of followers. I made some fun stuff. Explored life. Learned a little bit. Lit learned a little bit. Traveled. You're, this is gonna make people really upset. I'm biting into all of them. Mm -mm -mm. I'm documenting the truth. Extra vitamins for tomorrow. I asked my dietitian. <clears throat> Those things like vitamin C, vitamin C, B12. It's good to have it kind of run through the system, in her opinion. It's whatever. Also, I'm taking an extra uh, krill, which is anti-inflammatory. Hmm. Honey, I'm gonna call him. <clears throat> he was a little disappointed, and I was a little disappointed, but I'm over it now. Especially now that I'm not hungry anymore, I feel okay. He might say a curse word. Let's see. Can you please make me a cheese quesadilla? It's a thumbnail. It's a one cheeseburger. You need a thumbnail for one cheeseburger. Mm hmm. It's gonna be called 100 Days of Weight Loss. I can't eat, or I lost 89 pounds, or I'm allergic to eggs, something like that. 100 Days of Trolling. Wait, I'll take two cheese quesadillas, actually. Actually, it's going to be called, I don't believe in sounds. <laughs> Vitamins. But does it cancel out what I'm doing? No, no. I'm just joking when I say that. <clears throat> but does it help? Of course. Of course. You put someone on a horrible diet, and if they're deficient in iron, and you give them iron, it doesn't really matter what they're eating too much. They're going to improve their iron levels. <clears throat> yeah, so, some things inhibit the uptake of, and absorption of certain things. Something, some things need co-fast, co-binders and blah, blah. You know, iron is best with vitamin C. So you have vitamin C with your iron. Stuff like, you know. But, it can help. And I can still have my McDonald's. Okay. This is what my dietitian says, and I love believing her. She's never lied. Mm. No, I have no wonder. Those th that thing I'm about to get in my arm tomorrow, how do they prevent that from going bad? They say it has to be like negative 70 degrees. Where is that being stored all day long? Where? These places just have 
buckets of coolers and ice. Like, where are they? A, being kept. B, how do you know they're not expiring? How do you know they're not expired? Am I going to get an expired? <clears throat> I don't know. There's no way for me to know or verify. That's also kind of like, ooh. I want some fresh. I mean, I know I'm a little late to the game, <clears throat> but then again, 49% of this country has not done this yet. So, is this expired or not? I don't know. I really have to cut my hair, <clears throat> but only so many nervous things at a time, please. Cutting my hair makes me very nervous. Hmm. This is called elderberries, elderly berries. <clears throat> it tastes good because it has sugar, it's a gummy, but I, when I was in Vegas, which by the way, the you know what was going around, and I was concerned a little bit, but it was not nearly what's happening now. <clears throat> but when I was on that trip in West Coast, all the numbers had gone down, not completely, but it was not alarming like it is now. Ding, 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 ding. It was, we had just, we literally had gotten out of a huge thing. We were like going down very well and I still get masks gloves supplements blah 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 and I used to take the elderly berries it was this pack kind of like my vitamin C pack that I, I go I go ring, 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 ring. it was a pack called elderly berries and it's basically immune little things it comes from the elderly berry I don't know who grows that which country grows the elderly berries but it was disgusting. Ew. It was so gross. It was really, really gross. I hated that supplement so much. I don't mind the vitamin C. Tastes kind of nice. Also, when you drink citrus, you just know it's... You just know there's vitamin C. Sometimes you drink the elderly berries. I'm like, all I taste is metal and tannins and tonics and toxins. It was like, uh, it was like literally licking a spoon. Oh, it was so not enjoyable. But when you have something that's citrusy, you just know, oh, vitamin C. Anything with that ascorbic acid. Well, I'm starving today. I should put in the title, Today I Starved. <clears throat> and it's more than salt. Even though, poor baby, I'm just trying to do me a favor. Look at him schlepping around at, at two in the morning getting me food. Well, he's currently making me a cheese quesadilla, which he better do a good job. Oh, let's do my, well, I kind of want chips too. Let's see how long I have to wait for this. Oh my goodness. There you go. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> you want more? <laughs> yes. How many more? Well, I don't know. Let me see. <gasps> Ooh. Oh my gosh, it's like the, like the dumb hat. The dumb hat. <laughs> Hats for the low IQs. So this has mozzarella cheese. It has cheddar cheese. Oh. And what else? And olives and French onion dip. You don't like it? The cheese is cold. Oh. See, it's not mozzarella. You're so picky. 
I'm not picky. I'm just showing you. It tastes good. Two strikes. <clears throat> There's people in the comments be like, Orlin, you have all my permission to pop him square in the no nose. <laughs> That's why I have an affair. Uh-huh. Girl. Oh. Those are yours, honey. Do all of them. Sure. Amber gave us Amber gave us the protocol for tomorrow's special trip. Ooh. There, clean yourself. It's yumpa. <sighs> you want more? Well, then how much do you tell the people how much you weigh? What? Let's put on, let's put on the, the scale. 300. You know, I was vegan for a bit, but then I ate and... My thing's gonna die. No way. Brightness? Brightness is good. <clears throat> How much do I love my husband? Not enough. Not enough. Clearly enough. Having to go back to McDonald's at 2 a.m. Being treated like dirt at McDonald's. <laughs> I didn't, you offered, you said I would be, wait, eat. Okay, it, let's update. It's 2.30 in the morning. I'm falling asleep. I'm supposed to get my you-know-what tomorrow. So I'm trying to help my immune system be good, but. Yeah. Your immune system's not really going to be good. Look at what you eat every single day. Every single I video. I know. I know, that's what all the viewers are thinking. What's the last time you had a salad? Or this is no acting. I'm not acting. I'm just not happy. I'm not in a good mood. That's nice. That's nice. Oh, okay. I'm chewing. If you can't see it, I'm chewing. Mm. It's not better than usual. McDonald's can really hit the spot. I had a good McDonald's the other week. And I was blown away. You gotta have it fresh though. McDonald's. I got a fish sandwich. Cause you're like, they're so pricey. Are they? It's like $5 for it. Oh. Okay. Uh, That's mm. what we get for destroying our oceans. Mmm. Have a bite. Mm -mm. I'm so sleepy. I did red light therapy where I'm Amber says you have to get enough that's calories. I'm exhausted. Yeah, but you have to get enough calories to keep up your metabolism to feel ready for tomorrow. Amber's just full of it. All right, I'm gonna have a classic. Have you had a, your classic cheeseburger in a while? Mm -hmm. Have it with me, a classic. It has that McDonald's smell. I think this is what I would have you know, like growing up and stuff. It's the dollar menu. Yeah. yeah. It's not a dollar anymore, right? It's dollar twenty nine. Yeah. Hmm. When you and I are like ninety years old, they will be like ten dollars. That'll be the cheap burger. Ten dollars. That's the cheap one. The ten dollar menu. That is pretty, this one. Well, it's good actually. Uh. Mm, try the french fries. Mm, divine. No, yeah, they're good for that. Again, McDonald's is a whole different experience when you have it fresh. If I you wait like 20 more minutes for these french fries, they'll be completely different and like not packed. Yeah, you're used to eating my leftovers. Yeah. I'm so sleepy. Have this. 
I'm falling asleep. That red light therapy, I forgot how tired it makes me. Oh, because there's healing that has to be involved. This is a quarter pounder. Mm hmm. It's your favorite, right? Mm hmm. It's pretty today. So tired. You have to eat. People are just like, why are we watching this? I'm so sorry. You're being really boring. I'm not being boring. I'm tired. It's three in the morning and I have to get up for a super, super important day tomorrow. It's been a very rough day for me. I know, honey. I know. <clears throat> Will we be okay tomorrow? We'll be okay tomorrow. One, two, three. Look happy. No, you don't just don't look good. No. Days yet. The day is the day is over. Oh, it is three in the morning. It is over. True. This one's starting out bad then. Okay, people of the internet. I think we should say goodbye. Orlin loves to start and finish one thing before he tries anything else. I've noticed. I watch your videos sometimes. 
you'll eat the same thing till it's gone and then you'll go to something else. Instead of like tasting while it's all still hot, you'll eat one and then let the others get cold. I'm too fat to be a hummingbird. You're still eating that same sandwich. She wants to get every piece. Know what you're supposed to do? I don't know if there's rules. I'm just saying. That's okay. People get mad at me because I pick, 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 pick. I'll make pick, 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 pick. Ooh, it did the world's fattest hummingbird. Yes, going from flower to flower. No, I think you're funny. I'm gonna have diarrhea. Oh, you ate that? You ate the quarter pounder. No wonder we were quiet. Uh -huh. I was half asleep for that. <laughs> uh -huh. It's okay, you had three of them before this. I did see... Mm -hmm. That thing you made me, I appreciate you doing that, but it was so bad. The cheese was cold and hard. But it was nice that you did it for me. I do like your tortillas. I yeah, appreciate the seafood boil. It was nice of you to give it to me. <sighs> I'm gonna go to sleep. Someone's hungry. I'm just eating out of anger. This is my last bite. Mmm. The french fries are good today. Mm -hmm. There's so many. <laughs> but I can't be. You literally told me you were starving before this video. Sleep is overpowering right now. It doesn't matter. It's supposed to eat. What did you stay at home? I mean, we got a good. What was this minute? 10 minutes? Is that. I also feel like I have to go to number two. Yeah. Um. The french fries are good today. Oh, I heard a cat. You hear that? I'm like, is it 3 a.m. yet? Hearing yeah, all these noises go bump, bump, bump. <laughs> the french fries are good today. Why oh, do you have the AC on the diabetic setting? Because there's diabetes in this house. Mmm. It's on 71. They're just fat and sweaty. It's Florida. Do you know how much humidity can build up on 71? I'm cold. I have to do a TikTok tomorrow. Ugh. You guys, I'm going to say goodbye. I'm like floating out of out of tiredness. Wish us luck. We should be fine, like most people. Hmm. My friend, hung, with you today. my friend, hungry fat chick got it. So. Um. If she can do it. I can do it. <sighs> Actually, most of my friends have gotten it. Not all of them. Orlin, I'm like falling asleep. Hi, it's me. I'd like to thank all my patrons for supporting this video and an even bigger thank you to my executive producers, Jamie Baby Cotto, Princess Abby, and C Butter. If you'd like to support my channel a little bit extra, or if you just want to see the real unfiltered side of these videos, click the link in the description box and consider joining all of us over on Patreon. You'll get to see weekly videos and a much more candid side of me. Oh, and by the way, you have to be a grown-up to follow. Patreon's really for my closest followers only and new openings become available 
available on a first come first serve basis. So if you see an opening, hurry up. And if you want to hear from me personally, get yourself a video directly from me on Cameo, where I can surprise you with a video straight to your phone or your computer. You can also hire me to tell off your friend. If you want more, check out my merch store and get yourself a Waterweight t-shirt. Patreon, Cameo, and merch are all linked in the description box. Thank you so much. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.